Welcome back to my channel, I'm Papa Ross, and today I'll be teaching you how to obtain and use the tractor and all of his attachments. First and foremost, you need to talk to this guy, Franklin. You have to donate a bunch of shiny discs to him, and once you've donated enough, he will have the option to make a tractor, which is at the bottom of the list, for 1.5 million dink. Make sure you have all these items as well, because you're going to need them in order to craft this item. Once you've decided to craft it, he will make it, and then he'll send it to you in the mail. But before you can even commission him to make this item, you must have the license to do so. So let's go head over to Fletch. In order to have that item made for you, you have to have the license by talking to Fletch. And you just go to the very bottom of the list where it says Agricultural Vehicle License and get the first one to have the ability to even purchase and make the tractor. And the other two are for the attachments, which we'll go over here in a minute. But once you've got your license and once you've got your tractor, go ahead and set your tractor up. Here's the tractor right here. As you can see, Erwin is admiring it. In order to get into the tractor, of course, you're gonna to wanna to press A or whatever button that you use to jump into vehicles. Use that same button to use the attachments. When I first got into the vehicle, I didn't even know how to get the attachments. All you have to do is use the same button that you use to get into the tractor to switch between the different ones. Allow me to demonstrate how the tractor works. So without any attachments, you're just gonna drive the tractor regularly. Well, with the first attachment, as you can see at the very top, it's going to be an up arrow. And then the middle one's going to be like a grid. And then the last one's going to be a down arrow. The up arrow means that you're harvesting whatever you're plowing over. The grid means that you're tilling the ground, like so. And the down arrow means that you're planting seeds, like so. So it plants a potato seeds because that's what I have highlighted. Now let's go through here and I'll show you how it harvests. Now I'm not using any stamina to do this and notice how the sprinklers are not being damaged whatsoever. You go right over top of them. And imagine all of the farming you can do in just a few seconds by using that tractor. Now the turning is a little bit stiff, but once I get rid of all these fences, that won't be a problem. I'll just go outside of the actual tilled earth and then come back onto it. But with the fences, it makes it like really difficult to actually plow. But this is a really good item to have. It's really good for every part of the farming process, whether it's harvesting or making a grid of tilled earth or putting down more seeds so this usually would take me a couple of in-game hours to pick up everything and then put everything back down but with this tractor it's gonna cut that down to seconds anyway that's how you use the tractor if you have any questions make sure you leave it in the comments down below and happy plowing i'll see you guys in the next video peace